Lawyer Kenneth Feinberg estimates he's taken on about half a dozen of the nation's most difficult tasks as special master over the years. He oversaw the September 11th Victims' Compensation Fund during former President George W. Bush's administration. He administered a similar fund for victims of the Deepwater Horizon spill during the Obama administration. He also oversaw CEO pay for companies that received government bailouts during the 2008 financial crisis. However, in an exclusive interview, he told CBS News senior investigative correspondent Catherine Herridge that if he were asked to be special master in the case involving the documents seized from former President Donald Trump's Florida residence, the answer would be no. And the idea that this is a judicial function, I'm very dubious about that, Feinberg said. The department and the national security agencies, the CIA, they have information and valuable insight into all of this. And I'm not sure a federal judge, district court or appellate court really has that sophistication and that experience to be able to make those conclusions second-guessing allegedly. The Justice Department and Trump's legal team were to submit a list of potential special master candidates acceptable to both parties by Friday. Feinberg doubts that a consensus candidate exists. I think it's very likely that the judge will have to appoint someone that she deems appropriate over the objection of one side or the other, he told Herridge. I don't see the two sides getting together. But again, that'll await an appellate review if there's going to be a special master at all. In any case, he has some advice for any of those possible candidates. What makes these assignments so unique and so difficult is the emotional overhang, the political overhang, Feinberg said. And I would ask, or I would suggest to anybody who's considering this, think long and hard. There are people over the years in the national security apparatus who have wonderful resumes, exemplary service to the people of this country. Now, you're being asked to take on an assignment that has the potential to tarnish that reputation and bring you into the political polarization of.